Hello, everybody. This is going to be a review on this uh, Orphan Killer mask replica that I made. Yeah, so, uh, so yeah, let's just get straight into it. So basically, the movie The Orphan Killer is a, it's a movie that was made by a small production company. It's not anything official. It's on YouTube, uh, free to watch. Yeah, just basically just type in The Orphan Killer movie and yeah, it'll come up. It also has a sequel, but honestly, I haven't watched the sequel because, like, I don't really want to. And, like, this is, like, good enough for me. I'm afraid the sequel might ruin it. So, yeah, basically, this is the Orphan Killer. And, like, this is the Orphan Killer's mask, anyway. And not, like, this is going to be, like, a few spoilers if you're, if you haven't seen it yet. But, like, honestly, I doubt very few of you will actually watch it. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, basically, so it's about this guy, uh, the orphan killer. He basically, and this is going to sound wrong, he kills orphans, but not in the way that you think. And he's also an orphan that is a killer. So, like, the orphan killer works both ways. Basically, he was in a religious, like, just like uh, an orphanage run by nuns. And they seen evil in him. Uh, I'll say what that is in a second. And basically, they forced him to wear this mask that just kind of, like, hides... They say it uh, shields the devil for, like, people looking at the devil in his eyes and all of that. Yeah, but the thing is... I think it's meant to be like he's he, like he hasn't taken it off since he was a child. Like, he never took it off, ever. Like, that's why it's this destroyed, like, uh, this is, uh, like, white paint. Because it used to be painted like a skull. Like, that's the thing, like, it used to be a skull, and, like, that's how long he's wearing it, but, like, all the paint is chipped off it. So, yeah, pretty much. So, I know it's not the most accurate to any, like, really big Orphan Killer fans, but, I've, like, it's recognisable as the Orphan Killer. Uh, uh, Tots uh, actually make a Orphan Killer mask, and, but, like, I was too lazy, like, I, not even too lazy, I just didn't want to buy because, like, I could easily make that. So, I just started, just made a sculpture, a decent one, and just made, like, a throwaway mould, because I only wanted one pulled out of it. And, yeah, this guy came out. And I know the stitching isn't the most accurate. His has actual grommets with actual, um, like, straight, like, not, uh, kind of like rope kind of stuff. Like, these are just letter, straight, like, letter, letter strings. I don't really know what they are. And yeah, this hole on the top is uh, accurate as well. But basically, this here, in the movie, a, like, one of his victims, she actually, like, snuck up behind him with a hammer and, sm and just smacked him on the head with it. Basically, yeah, that's, like, his literally exposed brain, which I think is pretty, like, gnarly. So, yeah, and, like, yeah, the, orphan like the orphan killer, he's a pretty evil guy. And, yeah, like, he has, like, a pretty sinister, evil-looking mask to go along with it. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye.